have chased after kids who don't believe that I am Obi-Wan Kenobi. <laughs> you are a Jedi. Your father is a very old friend. I don't believe you. Leia. I am. I am Obi-Wan Kenobi. <laughs> <laughs> As they run away, Mommy, it's not him at all. <laughs> no, I was doing that. So, here we are. Episode Hello. four. It's always three. such a pleasure. Three. Oh, right, yeah. three. Episode three. <laughs> Not even that bad. Don't yet. jump the gun. You idiot. You I haven't got a gun. Fucked it all up. Rags is the wait, one with the guns. Wait, I do have many guns. I'm just saying, don't I have a gun jump next it, to me right all. now. What does it that is, even mean, jumping a gun? Way. Don't jump it. I think a gun would be pretty easy to do. Yeah. Why yes, can't I jump it? Is it dangerous to do that? To Put it on the floor. Look, I'm just saying. Over the gun isn't loaded. I think I can jump it. Even if it was loaded. You're my friend. You should believe in me, Frank. I think I can do it. Same size. I'm just saying, be careful, that's all. Doesn't that apply to just anything that I'm doing? What's so dangerous about jumping sure, over? I'm just saying, be careful. It's like Boring. a threat, I don't know. Yeah, I'm starting to think you're you're evil. You're the dark side. Oh, no. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Becomes so obvious. Uh, so yeah, you know, all of you out there listening, you're probably like, woohoo, another episode of this awesome show. <laughs> and we we're like, oh hand. no, I'd rather kill myself. But here we are. We have criticism to discuss. And just some clarification oh, as well. Boy. When you edit these things, uh, you, you're like, oh, wow, we didn't even talk about this thing because we, we, we're too busy talking about another thing. And so there's just some stuff that I was curious to, to, to talk to you guys about, you know, before we start this one up, whatever fucking is coming. So we, we kind of went over it, but it was just to clarify, right? Like the whole uh, force mental grabby flumes. I actually saw some uh, people discussing this and they were like, Vader used it on Luke in Return of the Jedi. So it was the OT that established force mind grab feelings thing. And I was like, oh, yeah, technically that does happen when Luke is like, he, he's, he's trying to hide from Vader, if you guys remember, in Return of the Jedi. And Vader's all... Um, I've never seen that problem. Oh, well. Um, but he, yeah, it's, he, he pulls his sister from his thought. Your thoughts betray you. Your feelings for them are strong. Especially for... Sister. Which is like, see? So they can do it. And I was just like, I feel like the, the, these were presented in very different uh, dynamics. I think it helps Return of the Jedi that Vader and Luke have been around each other for a decent amount of time at that point. So that, you know, he's just, he's just trying to, to tap into whatever he's got there, which seems to me like an extension detecting people in general who have like force flumes or at least people you care about a lot you know there's a couple of things that are kind of hard to define but force awakens went as far as basically just saying it is a a move you can do and you will pull out specific information pulling out that luke has a sister that he cares about i think is a lot more vague than the location of the plans to the fucking whatever it was the the map to luke skywalker in bb8 he's like he knows exactly where that is. Um, and then this, of course, has a pull out exactly where Kenobi is or has been sent from the guy who so very fucking kindly offered his mind to Eva. If we throw out the criticism then that Vader should have used it on Leia when he met her in, in A New Hope, which I still think is valid, but fine, if we throw that out, it still destroys this show, being that Reva should have been using this. Well, all the Inquisitors should have been using this on, like, everybody. Doesn't make any sense anymore at all. Would have been really useful. And fuck it, oh. dead. you know, Owen would be dead. He'd be dead like, as a doornail. It feels like an ex extension of the same power, right? In terms of, um, if, it, if it is the same power, it feels like, oh, you're just doing it much better than uh, Vader do it. So if we just accept that Reaver is much better than Vader, then yeah. Great. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Fine. Fine. I mean, on those little top trump cards, uh, I think Ray is considered way more powerful than Luke and Vader. So, you know. Well, I mean, yeah. And, and I've seen the films. Raver, Reaver, Ray. It's all it's, it's R words when they start with Ray the R words. Skywalker. No, no. Don't say not, the R word. Not the, not the hard R. Raytard? Um, no. <laughs> so, you guys remember what scares off Leia in this really stupid scene where she escapes Kenobi? Do you remember what it was? Yeah, that guy's a bounty hunter. Part, he's seen yeah. his bounty, then bumps right into Kenobi. Really dumb. But when he's yeah. down, his thing just activates for no reason at all. Why is there a picture of you? And then for some reason, Obi-Wan, because he's very canonically a very unintelligent character, can't think of any way to rationalize that to Leia. And so Leia concludes, she literally says, and I can't believe this, I really didn't take this in the first time. She says, You were hiding. You're the reason I'm here. They took me to get to you. And I was like, how the fuck did she figure that out? Like, from him being a bounty for some, for people, especially when he's just counter-kidnapped a princess. You'd think, like, yeah. that's good enough reason alone to, to have a, a bounty established on him. He's going to have pissed off loads of people. But he doesn't try to explain anything in any way. She just says that, 
And, 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 and the crazy thing is, is, she's right. That is what's happening. But there's just no way she could possibly know that. And then, of course, that's enough reason for her to run away. When it's like, wait a minute, why would that make you want to run away? He they, still seems to be trying to rescue you. If you're, you're, in, the same, you're in the same boat, if they find yeah, you... If you are correct, and he is getting captured, or they're using you to get to him, you still want to be with him, because otherwise you'd be in a prison. Again. <laughs> Yeah, like that's I don't. Very selective childhood stupidness. Well, so yeah. th that's what the conversation has become that building, yeah. about Leia uh, that I've seen in some threads, where it's like people can't handle that she's an intelligent character. She always has been, and it's like, but she's not though. Yeah. Uh, also, she's true. ten, so let's um, calm the fuck down. I think down. I saw, I think I saw a thread where where someone said that quote unquote canonically she got like her PhD at nineteen and was a senator, and which is different than fuck. being ten. I know, I know. I'm just no, it's well, not. And it's going different than it. being smart. I think the reason why it's it's annoying is because the character is simultaneously smart and stupid when the plot needs her to be. Yes. So it's like, yeah. Would we be would we be happy would we be happy if any like really smart character reached that conclusion that quickly? Because I don't think we would. Well, no, not it, it's not even about being available. smart. She gets it from nothing. There's no way she can conclude what she concludes well, through critical she thinking because she doesn't got the components she needs. The writer knows that that's why. Um, exactly. So she knows. Wait, she wouldn't this um, so wouldn't this make sense if like uh, she's read the script? Yes. <laughs> Last yeah. Girl. And yeah, so that's 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 what I mean. The discussion is about is she in character, and a lot of people are like, yes, she is. She was always clever, and the response is just like, but she ain't clever, so you can't even use that. But mm -hmm. she's only as clever as she needs to be to make things happen. So yeah, it was really clever when she jumped off the fucking building. I don't know how in character someone needs to be like as a child. Like there is, there are going to be things exactly. that are distinctly different about them. Oh, yeah. would... You are different people. You're just fucking flat out different people. They made her really bratty. Um, I don't think they realized they Leia was a lot of fun, and she would snap back at people who were uh, treating her as though she wouldn't be able to hold her own sort of thing. Governor Tarkin, I should have expected to find you holding Vader's leash. Short for a stormtrooper. You came in here, didn't you have a plan for getting out? He's the brain! We are. Into the garbage, fly boy! I take orders from just one person, me. So one day still alive. Like, it, it's not a matter of just, you know, uh, if you remember, there's this part where um he says, you know, we're gonna, our story is that we're from this planet, you're my daughter. And then she's like, granddaughter, maybe. And like, mm. it, it drives me nuts watching it because I'm just like, so she really doesn't grasp that she's been kidnapped from her family, led to a different planet. They are currently under watch from like everybody in this city and they could be shot at any moment. And you might be like, oh, it's just a little bit of levity. It's just like, no, 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 it's just out of character. You should be terrified. She's a 10 year old. Levity is only funny when it's in character. Sometimes, it feels like sometimes something can be funny just because it's really in character and you're like, hey, that is what they want. Well, I guess my point now. is you can find it funny, but it's annoying me because it's not how she should be behaving, I guess. Yeah, she's not, Leia's not a bitch. Well, no. the thing. I, I don't find it funny because it's out of character. Yeah. I don't find it funny because it's, it's just, yeah, it's weird coming from this creature. Like, uh, it's, quips, it's, are, quips are always way funnier if you understand the character and like how the character arrived at saying it. Like if you, if it is believably a thing that that person would say when, when they feel artificial and fake it drains the comedy appeal that they might have and part of what pisses me off about it is that it undermines kenobi's journey here like he's sacrificing mostly every piece of safety he has and his coverage of the boy he needs to take care of in order to have like to, to have witty comebacks from this annoying girl that he's trying to sacrifice everything for i'm just mm -hmm. it really fucks with me like he's like you know daughter and father from this planet anyone asks we're hiding and then she's like you're old <laughs> okay like all right then i'm telling you man I'm yeah like you, uh, you guys I know hate about her. it but um this is things referenced a lot in when i'm talking to the uh the fnt guys but when they were doing the witcher season two uh the the horse roach is, dies is a scene for that and apparently the writer uh. wanted it to have some jokes in it and henry cavill said no Oh. Good on Henry. Good. <laughs> Apparently that seems like not terrible. <laughs> so it's like, oh, that's nice. And Good yeah, on you, Henry. In a what sense, a I'm sitting here like, oh man, because oh, uh, Ewan McGregor is executive producer, and mm. I'm pretty sure he'll defend the shit out of every choice made for writing in this. And it's like, oh, that's a shame, but you go ahead, yeah. man. I want to destroy my own character. Hell yeah, let's go. <laughs> well, <laughs> I didn't uh, yeah, there there was... that. the only other thing I wanted to talk about was... And this is just going to yeah. stretch everyone's knowledge of the OT, including myself. Um, oh, my Anakin, Skywalker, <laughs> Darth Vader. Would you have guessed that was public knowledge or not from the OT? Not. No. No, no. I would have not thought not. Knowledge. The problem is I don't think I have anything in stone to argue that. Mm. Um, I would have just assumed, right? 
I'm trying to think of all the references, because you know that Tarkin knows that Vader is a remnant of the Jedi. Doesn't ever refer to him as Anakin, not that he has well, to. Well, he, he would probably think that of Palpatine, but he'd never say it to his face. Um, maybe. Yeah, you could be right. Uh, the, the Sith must be a corruption of the Jedi, and Tarkin would be familiar with the Jedi for how old he is. I would have assumed that it would be one of those known secrets. Um, those things that, like, most people, or at least a lot of people, assume to be true, but there is no confirmation of it, and, um, it's kind of kept sort of hush. Your father was seduced by the dark side of the Force. He ceased to be Anakin Skywalker and became Darth Vader. When that happened, the good man who was your father was destroyed. I've accepted the truth that you were once Anakin Skywalker, my father. That name no longer has any meaning for me. It is the name of your true self you've only forgotten. We're gonna probably get a flashback to explain how Reva knows. And so, if that's that, then I guess... Because this is the, the thing that we, we, we covered it, we were just like, how in the fuck would she know and Obi-Wan doesn't? How have we gotten to this point where she's the one that delivers that information to him, I guess? Because it really was a completely hidden secret, except she knew because of something that's going to have happened when we get another flashback, presumably at some point, with the Order 66 shit? I don't know. Because he would know that Darth Vader is still around, surely. Surely, well, so, like, so, Obi-Wan knows that. And he knew that Anakin was... He knew that, didn't he? Because he, he watched the footage. He knew Anakin was um, the Emperor's... Right hand man but he thought he was dead but the only question but i have is in that well, recording I, doesn't I he refer he to him as lord vader that. that's what i'm saying that is i thought that was a recording when he's like you shall henceforth be known as darth vader. like i thought he knew no this. that's that's obi-wan's not in that scene he's he's bowing no, to the recording right yeah but he doesn't say doesn't you shall that. henceforth be known as thingy vader when oh, uh, yeah, right, right right because he's i think well, he just says so well be, done lord vader which is enough that's enough well and also even if you didn't have that it's like man who is this like mysterious incredibly powerful force user who is like because darth vader would be known as an entity surely like just it's his as, job to be known Obi that's the point no well what i mean is Ob darth vader the figure is would be known in the galaxy yeah. And oh yeah. Obi Wan would have enough information to know that Darth Vader is Anakin. Like I, I don't think it would be a surprise to him that he's alive. Well, yeah, it, I always, I always. So I'm looking to go further to inference, and yeah, I just checked the scripts. It can't be. It can't be. You have done well, my new apprentice. Now, Lord Vader, go and bring peace to the Empire. I can't watch anymore. Sorry, Obi Wan. That, Obi Wan heard that. So yeah, like. I will not kill Anakin. Twisted by the dark side, young Skywalker has become the boy you trained. Gone he is, consumed by Darth Vader. So know. what that means we need to accept in this show is that he's never heard of Darth Vader. Which in is the absurd. Ten years. No way. No way he doesn't know. Well, it's so impossible. It's, I'm, just, to... I'm not even I'm not going to say it's a contrivance. It's impossible that Bail Organa did not tell Obi-Wan about any of this. Yeah. Bail's on the Senate. He knows about Vader. Or alternatively, that if he hadn't heard it from Bail, that he wouldn't have just heard it anyway. Like That's what I'm saying. About about how it's an impossibility it, otherwise we have to believe that he just never heard any i guess they get no news out there and nobody talks about anything yes he must have been living under a rock oh, oh. so yeah I, um, the, the way getting out of here is i'm pretty sure this can't work as a reveal no. um <laughs> well to be fair like if someone said to me we're gonna and, and it's, i don't even like the way it was revealed the fact that reva shouts it at obi-wan you didn't know that's lame <laughs> he's alive obi-wan <laughs> yeah Actually, yeah. Anakin Skywalker is alive. Imagine, yeah, because I was about to say wait, ways we could oh, do it, but I guess you didn't know. <laughs> where, where are you? <laughs> this is a great reveal. Revealio. That's the Harry Potter thing, probably. I'm gonna stab a guy, and it's not you. Yeah, that's that's the spell that makes someone's pants oh, fall down. I have seen loads of people nice. arguing over whether or not the Grand Inquisitor's dead. It's quite funny. Nobody knows. That's yeah. hilarious. That you can't <laughs> that's even because know that now, sure. and yeah. Well, because he he appears after this in Rebels. You're not going near it. I believe I am. Which is definitely. That's just the this. writing now. It's Plus we're the, just I, like, oh, yeah. we saw someone get stabbed Honestly, straight through the chest with a lightsaber and fall to the ground, and we're just like, well, we don't even know if he's dead. We have no idea what the stakes are when it comes to life and death anymore. I was gonna yeah, say. That's all I, I saw someone did. defending this decision with, hey, people, so, like, as in, like, hey, people, people are complaining that he has to be a, a life of rebels, but this is Star Wars. People survive getting sliced in half, uh, and Palpatine survived getting blown up. 
I'm sure yeah, he thinks it's like, oh, it's fucking twice. stupid. I was like, oh, you're you're def you're speaking positively. They are, yeah. Great. <laughs> anyway, uh, um, I love it when there are no stakes. I imagine when we record for episode four, that'll be the longest one because I'll have even more clarifications that I want to go through, and we'll have a first shot comment Ooh. showcase in a while. Pogolon. Oh. In fact, um, this is a comment that I saw not from uh from any of our videos, but from oh, the comment section under right. I think it was Real BBC, and I was like, you know what? I wouldn't mind reading this out. This is pretty funny. This is how it goes. Reva, I need to kidnap Leia to draw out Kenobi because of an off-screen super tenuous connection that Bale has with this fugitive Jedi that I'll use in the hope uh, it draws him out. All of this relies on the idea that Bale knows where Kenobi is, can contact him, and Kenobi will respond. Also, Reva can force suck information. <gasps> out of people and never thinks to apply this power to Bail Organa. Obi-Wan has no idea Anakin is alive, has no idea Vader is Anakin, doesn't know anything, completely lost. Anakin. Also Kenobi is in open communication with Bail Organa for important things. Bail Organa... Oops, sorry. Ah, what the fuck's happening? Oh, sorry. <laughs> The plot, that's just the Disney plot. <laughs> also, Kenobi is in open communication with Bail Organa for important things. Bail Organa, who is, according to Disney's own canon, at this point, the leader of the Rebel Alliance and knows about Darth Vader. The leader of the Rebel Alliance, who is, by the way, regularly working uh, with... Sorry, it's in two pieces. Uh, oh, it's fine, I forgive you. With an actual Black Ops Jedi named Ahsoka Tano, who could totally track down Leia, kill the kidnappers, who has a live-action counterpart, but he doesn't mention her at all. But, I don't know, maybe Obi-Wan would like to know his brother's former apprentice survives uh, 66, and maybe that'd be something Organa would share, but no, Obi-Wan knows nothing, because why would he? Fuck, this show is broken. <laughs> um, yeah. So it's getting to the point, when I read this, I was like, man, I'm not even able to keep track of how many things are breaking, because there's just so many things happening at once in this timeline. Like, Ahsoka Tano, mm. she's not going to be mentioned at all. No, she won't pop up, even though she was his apprentice, canonically. Yeah, um, Obi-Wan probably doesn't like know that. she exists, unless they decide he does. And then well, like, yeah, Obi-Wan must know that she it exists, be because they interact with videos. each other all the time. In the, uh, not in the until world. they decide he does. <laughs> well, that's the thing, it's like, at this point, because I remember it was like, wait, but how, where does all of this fit in the timeline? Who is around? Who's active now? Like, what organizations yep. are... Or, and where are they? Like, it's feels like they don't remember their own timeline at this stage. It's unreal we're not, to me. We're, we're now at the point, because normally we talk about, oh, they just do the things and then whatever comes after me, that's for the other ones to figure out. Yeah. But now we start in between things and they don't figure out anything that comes after or before or no. in between or in their own show. Yeah, and they just... It's like, oh, we're just going to do stuff. And it's and like, they... nah, nah. They legitimately forget people who would have to be around at this point and who would be relevant to the storyline, and they invent brand new people that we've never seen or heard of before yep. and desperately hope they can get rid of them and their impact on the story before it gets to the timeline we're familiar with where they don't have well, any it's impact. Like the, it. It's like the book of Ashanti or Vishanti. It doesn't Vishanti. even matter. The book of the Magic Good Book. Yeah. You introduce it, get rid of it, and the same thing. Despite its impact on the multiverses yeah. and everything, introduce it, get rid of it. Close that loop. So, um, yeah, that, I just find it hilarious. There's all these different reasons for why everything's fucked, and we've got more. And remember, this is the same thing that happens with every D Disney show. It'll get worse as we go. It always does. Yeah. Even if yeah, there was no canon stuff. surrounding this, no prequels, no OT, no anything else, this show is already deteriorating completely. Mm -hmm. It didn't have to be this drawn cringe. out and complicated and cringe. You know, it's it. This, this couldn't. They must have batted around a bunch of ideas, but they settled for this Are for some sure? god for. Uh, yeah, I guess maybe this. It literally was just some, just somebody's random idea that they just had, and they went with it. Should we discuss other ideas? No, this is perfect. What are you talking about? Um, it, might it. Be, I love um, it. it might be that it's like the whole like um, committee thing is like that there are loads of people pushing for certain things and they're trying to figure out how to give them all their way or something like that. You know, we don't know what fucking Frankenstein process they use to make these. You know what people want to see? A ten-year-old Leia. Yeah, now make her a bitch. Anyway, I'll you guys want to start it up? <laughs> no, let's yeah. do it. Yeah, no, not particularly. <laughs> All right, no, none of us are on board. Three, two, Damn it. one. Motion. Wait, are you ready? Click. Oh, no, I was, wait, wait uh, now I've got to go back. Yeah, I was ready. Right, I'm ready. <laughs> All righty then. Three, two, one, go. Previously oh. on. The girl has been dun, 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 The girl. <laughs> I'm going to miss the Grand Inquisitor. He was funny. Oh, apparently that lady who gave him the drugs is, is, is uh, Ewan McGregor's... Ewan McGregor's... <laughs> Ewan McGregor's real life daughter. Oh, okay. okay. That's neat. Neat. Yeah. Good old yeah, McGregor. Remember when...
Oh, no, Imagine if we had exploded. Exploded. we didn't have those silly outfits and they like purposefully blended in mm. to crowds and things and you didn't know it was them. So they were hunting you down, but they looked just like normal people. Well, that'd be cool. Yeah. I'm still baffled that they have a character that's connected to the OT and the prequels, an actor who's more than willing and ready, and they didn't make movies out of him. I think this is basically confirmation that um, shows are more profitable for them now. That's what <laughs> I want leaning a lot more into shows now. Well, I, I wonder if we'll be seeing any more movies. <sighs> Ah, uh, uh, yeah, we are. Taika Waititi's next up, All apparently. Right. Bum, 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 and because bum. of the pacing, they'll be fighting with each other long before this episode's even over, probably. Oh, great. Probably will be, like, the third act. Oh, do oh. you think Darth Vader will take his helmet off? <laughs> uh. <laughs> no, they're not allowed, okay? This is a little bit worried, not gonna lie, because, uh, yeah. I'm... <laughs> yeah, I, I, no. I'm, I'm weird, unlike you guys. I like Vader a lot, okay? Darth Vader's really fucking cool, and I don't like him he was, when they ruin yes. things. Why not? It's just, uh, it's just not preferable, <laughs> you know? Well, have you considered liking it? It's a children, Molo. <laughs> You're a children. Damn, correct, Jay. Oh. Alright, we're off to a good start. Nothing makes nothing, no sense yet. No, oh, good. Floor, Wait, they I mean, haven't screwed oh, up okay, the floor so, yet. <laughs> okay, so, floor. no, but like, okay, if someone who knows about floors, is there anything wrong with this floor? Maybe this is a design. <laughs> um, well, so sense. something I would say is if he's kneeling on this with his knees, it's probably going to hurt with all of the yeah, like, probably, weights yes. that he's, he's probably kneeling on. He's actually yeah. doing that, though. Yeah, yeah, sure, I'm just saying it would probably hurt a little bit. He's using Qui -Gon the side by kneeling on this floor. Qui-Gon is definitely going to show up in this. It would be really funny if he doesn't. Is that Chewbacca? He's a man. Oh. Oh, it's Reaver. Yeah. He's alive, Obi-Wan. He that screamed no. The first scene is going to establish what we just saw in the last episode. Oh, that was Yoda. You don't need the flashback if the first scene is like, hey, remember last episode? Promise me you will dream, the boy. There he is. Not, not fair. There's so enemy. much potential. Don't uh -huh. make me kill we're not gonna get a we're not gonna get a show that focuses on the character of him learning to overcome any sense of guilt that he has and moving forward with his People life. People will claim that's what the show does. That yeah, they will claim that. Look what they claimed about Boba Fett. That's about as much as they could possibly do, and you know they wanted more. Without the helmet on. I don't think they should have showed his face. They really shouldn't have. Well, dude, playing, uh, if people watch this chronologically, getting his face reveal is, is crazy important in, in the OT, That's and now it's like, yeah. by the way. Well, I think well, that they don't make these at this point thinking that people will watch chronologically. No. They're fully aware of the meta. Oh boy, Mustafar. Mustafar! Mustafar. Like, so... Did he build a temple on the planet where he melted? <laughs> that's, 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 we, knew, we knew this. We knew this. This is something that they established back in Rise of Skywalker, I think. It's a nice CGI temple he got the there. The Grand Inquisitor means nothing. Kenobi is all that matters now. Is that understood? Uh, is he? Yes, my lord. What, is that James Earl Jones? I have been watching you. Yeah, yeah that's James Earl Jones. Sister. Yeah. Sounds like a I'm just trying. The, the, the problem is, is I'm trying to figure it out because it's like his voice is so different now. Prove yourself. And the position of Grand Inquisitor is yours. Wow. Yeah, they don't care about you like I cared about him. Didn't one of us say she would end up getting a Grand Inquisitor role? Maybe they're so gonna like, make up a Mandalorian rule it's like, oh, you killed the biggest one, now you are the biggest one. I just had this one happen. They'll stab you in the face. Well, she'll be killed Wait, before then anyway. Sorry, when was it established that he had a castle on the planet where he melted? Well, so this um, is the thing. That could be, it could have been that it, that was the same thing in Extended. Um, but I'm pretty sure... Uh, <laughs> what a great view. The lore for Rise of Skywalker says that one of the waypoint finder things is on Mustafar because it's mm. Jet Vader's right. temple. That's, that's like what it it's says. Been, um, it's I been guess established I'm just wondering. In, like, in like wider media for ages, but I don't it's know if it's great. been just oh, being in now. I think it's pretty cringe, okay. whoever came up with it. Well, I just find it funny that you would build a temple on the planet where, like, you melted, <laughs> you know? Weird, weird, like, you know weird. Weird. Yeah. It's a weird thing to do, never, but, you know, it's what do you want to do? never want to be there. Well, people would say, like, it's a Sith it's thing a to focus on his pain and anguish. So, I think it's safe to say that we're going to get that helmet off pretty quick, then. Why would you credit uh, Hayden you Christensen as being back dark? if it's going to be well, James I thought they were going to have three cool flashbacks. Maybe they will, yeah. They could also have Obi-Wan, like, have visions or something. Maybe. Noah. I but I think they're gonna take him the helmet off actually. You fixed her. Great, he fixed the little robot. Yay! No, we thank can goodness. sell more toys. Yeah, thank goodness. Also has a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a 
Okay, cool. Hello, I like this little uh, thing about the light in the forest. That was... forest. What does it feel like? Have you ever been afraid of the dark? How does it feel when you turn on the light? I feel safe. Yes, it feels like that. That was, that was all right. We're on approach. No, we're on a ship, Obi Wan. I, I sometimes I wonder. I wonder how long they were on their way Wait. here. This was just to get them That's off the that planet, ship. right? They don't really know where they're yeah, going, or I don't know where they're going. I don't think. Yeah, just go here and talk to Glumber Khan. Whoever this or ship will take Glumber Khan, okay. yeah. Welcome to yeah. Planet Dead Jedi. Oh, this is a mining planet. Look at there's all those no, mining hills. There's no road down there. Why would the Why would you land here? There is no road there. There's no right. road that goes I guess, down. I guess you'll fly. Maybe down. they get on another ship. You, you yeah. Get, yeah, everyone gets a complimentary parachute. Oh look, it's Master Chief. Great, a great equipy robot. Take your helmet off. <laughs> wow, that's 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 no, his that helmet's ship, on. That can't be Master Chief. That ship was a lot smaller than I thought it was. <laughs> yeah. I thought that ship was a lot bigger than uh, that. Yeah, I guess they're. Uh... Good, yeah. You know what? Good. Behave as though you don't want to be seen by people. I would prefer that. Yeah, yeah. Why? It's refreshing compared to the last episode. Oh, Stormtroopers. Well, That's given good. that there are Storm around. Yeah. I'm sure they'll be, sure they'll be dead in no time. Oh, they're walking there. I guess they just walk down and they'll be the hill. Dead. Do you guys have food and well, water? They have, they have a... Wouldn't well, it say the meeting point is further north? That is, if our new friend was telling the truth. Why would he lie? People are not all good, Leia. Why would he lie? Why are you angry? Why would you no, she's this? asking you because you have no reason to think he's lying. Yeah. He hasn't lied so far. Was that supposed to be like him tapping into his feelings about Anakin or something? And then the Empire came over in the top. and ravaged and it was like this here. There were fields and families. And then the Empire came in and ravaged it all. Why did anyone ever support the Empire? We're never going to get that. We're never like, going to get Empire that. They paid lip the service to that in Mando, and they didn't have the balls to even begin to exactly. actually exactly. talk about that. Why would the Empire ravage a planet, though? Like, Yeah, like, don't uh, they want to make money from they, it they, and it, support it? They, like, they, do they mine it? Is that the idea? Who that? Oh, there you go. It's Hayden Christensen. He's spooky. He's a spooky ghost. There you go, visions. Woohoo. You just hear a distant liar. Um, <laughs> You're not calling him Mr. Kenobi? Yes, no. It seems like the thing where you call him Mr. Kenobi. He's like, no, just call me Ben. Stay but they close. just skip that. Ben, 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 bitch. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's so sinister. It's God's butt plug. Can't you build, like, normal buildings? <laughs> no. In Star Wars, this is a normal building. Oh, hello. Yeah, why not? Let's see more of what she's up to. Anyone gonna be upset you stabbed that other Grand Inquisitor? No, or... no. Just she lying there on the planet. Much, she can, um, she can blame Obi Wan. Surely, that's how she'd get out of it. No, oh, okay, okay. Why did you build a base here? This is ludicrous. Why not, Rags? Water is fun. So okay, so when you're Sploosh, a villain, sploosh. you have a choice to build sploosh. your base in space, in a volcano, or underwater, right? Yeah, this is like the evil trope. They have to do it. He's in one of the mining systems. You do not know that. Oh, I trace voice. the manifest. We should send out all remaining probes. <laughs> oh, you can just do that? <laughs> I assume I assume that you actually not, can do that. Okay. Yes. How do you guys maintain any level of order within your yeah. organization <laughs> if they fight like this all the time? That's it. Mine. Why aren't you sitting in it then, bitch? <laughs> I just spoke with Lord Vader. You spoke to him yourself. He asked me to leave the hunt. <laughs> you oh, I don't believe you. Oh, I don't believe you. Man, could you imagine Stand one of those fishes just decided to swim by? Like, what are you talking about here, buddies? <laughs> like, what's going on, guys? Just imagine Obi Wan swinging, swinging by. Like, <laughs> Send out the probes. Do it now. She just said, "Oh, I talked to Vader. I'm in charge now." And they're yeah. like, "Okay." How does okay. how does this military function? Do you not have like orders that you issue out? Well, like, is there I an email? Or if just... you kill the general, you become the general. We said this. Oh, 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 it's like Chronicles of Riddick. You have a lot of probes. You should be sending out a lot of these. Why? Would, yeah. Why wouldn't this just be the first thing you do? They're gonna have to get into hyperspace, right? You can't just. Yeah. They. Oh, they're they're very slow. They're gonna be. They have hyperspace on board. Shut up. Maybe. I can't talk, or I don't like talk. You don't talk. Got it. This is it. This is where he told us to come to. We discussed our Maybe backstory we literally as we arrived. Maybe yeah. it was a lie. Bro, you, you just got here. No one is coming here, Leia. Why would you assume what? that? What? Look around. Look. Just, just we a, use your eyes. Give them at least an hour. Well, if we're on our own, we're going to need some help. What are you doing? Wait, oh, okay. Okay, yeah. There's, oh, nobody's look, coming, I guess. Right we we just know this is true. Nobody's coming. No, we have to look around. Dude, what if we have to see if there's like something here? 
So if anybody does show up for the for you guys now, five minutes later, you that's just it. Nice. Yeah, I guess okay. we'll just trust this random local. Okay. Who's this dredge guy? What's up, He's buddy? A you need a ride? This is, my friend, this is my friend, my father. This is my father, Orden. We're farmers from Tall. Hey there, I'm Frank. Oh, he's so friendly. Oh, yeah. He is. Look at the mole man. Hello. We were going on a trip and we got a little lost in this field. Uh, Why are you letting her doing the talking? Doing talking. We yeah. got a bit turned around. We're looking for the nearest port. We need to get home. Well, I'm going that way. Jump in. Oh, that's no, lucky. that's all right. Thank you. We just need directions. Come on, Father. Well, just, We've just... walked long enough. Thanks, Rex. Oh, My pleasure. Why is she deciding Pop everything? Uh, it's kind of why funny. Why are you these, letting like, her in? Yes, Learn to you say no anything. to this child, Obi-Wan. You don't say anything, and then, like, five seconds later, she just he lets her do all the Okay, no, 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 no. No. Yeah. Yeah. You get out of there. Oh, okay. okay. No. Okay. All right, cool. Then. Yeah. Right. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, if you I needed love, more of a reason, but okay. Is that supposed to be like he's not Empire affiliated? He's just like flying a the fan flag. Of the Empire. Like he's, yeah, he's Maybe he's fans. working for them. What if or... he's like a fucking Empire transport thing? Like, what if this is How delivering can I hear to you? the Empire? Good people out tall. They pay their way. Listen to the Empire. Well, I know that voice. Nice to meet like-minded folk. Nothing wrong with a little order, right? They ravaged your planet. Yeah, yeah they did ravage. That's how you described it. <laughs> oh, how unfortunate. Oh, so oh no, they're out in the field. The there are these four random storms in the field. Where are they oh, going? So it's, it's what over. are they doing? It's over. Oh, we just spent a whole day ravaging, and boy, are we tired. Meet my new friends. Hey, is that Obi Wan Kenobi? What the fuck? <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> how would they not be made aware of? They must know. Surely he would be the number one target at this point. Yeah, they must be aware of Obi Wan Kenobi. How could they this not? This show be? doesn't have the balls to make them like nice and approachable. Hi there, citizen. How are you? Where are you all? No, they'll be oh. evil rags. Evil, evil, They're evil. They're moving us around, looking for a Jedi. What? Jedi? <laughs> <laughs> Out here? I hope we're not in any danger. Uh, they didn't tell us what he looked like. This is like an episode of Archer. Is this a joke? <laughs> All of these things would be happening as a joke. We're looking for possible Jedi in the area. I haven't Either. seen any Jedi. Oh, uh, no, we'll find them. We always do. <laughs> he kind of oh. looks like this guy. We're, we're huh? looking what a for a Jedi. It's weird well, how we'll you dress them, exactly how Jedi always dressed. Well, don't take this the wrong way, but the reason I stopped you is because you're dressed exactly like a Jedi. Like... All of them. It's weird how your face looks like the guy that, Man. that we're trying to find. Hey, That's kind of hey, weird. Hey, oh well. Have you seen any guys who look exactly like you? Because we're looking for <laughs> one. Every yeah. single one of them dressed exactly the way you're dressed now. Look, I'm not a Jedi. Scott, tell me this guy doesn't look like a Jedi. Yeah, yeah, he's got but like, the robes. Yeah, 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 the robes. Big hat. You a minor? No, uh, I'm not a minor. Oh. She's a minor. They know that he's got a little girl with him too. That's a long story. It's a uh. long way. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> God, he brought fucking me idiot. here. He brought me here to see the place. Oh, where thank he goodness met my she mother. can make up for his failings. Oh, great. Poor she. She's not with us anymore. It's been a very difficult time. I'm sorry to hear you? that. Are the they, Empire is working hard to turn things around. Jedi? What about you? Do you have any information about a Jedi? I would know one if I saw one. You haven't heard anything. Are you sure he's even on this planet? They know what they're doing, Leia. What? <laughs> oh, oh, no. uh, oh. Oh, come on. How come incompetent on, do you want to make him? Are you serious? <laughs> that was her mother's name. Oh, fuck off. What is this? Confused. They know that Leia is missing. Like I said, it's not been easy. Sometimes when I look at Luma, I see her mother's face. Uh-huh. Do you see how this looks to us, sir? Are you telling me you woke up today and accidentally dressed like a Jedi? Yes. <laughs> but every See, this is the moment where it's like they've made You're him incredibly him stupid, much. but they make the stormtroopers even stupider in order for the yeah. scene it's to like work. It's like a contest. Hey. You say you're not a Jedi, I have to believe you. I mean, there's nothing I can do. If you happen to see one, just find one of us and let us know, okay? Well, just keep your eyes open. Report it if you see anything. Of course. Boy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, <laughs> fuck off. God. Oh my god. Who fucking wrote this <laughs> shit, man? <laughs> this is so embarrassing. This is us! Thanks, Frack! Did you just say it was a long way? There was like two minutes. I was like, all over, Frack. We just saw an unravaged field. We gotta go. Uh, there you and go. Take care of that. House over there. That base. Yeah. It's a long walk. Oof, that was That's close. Good walk. thing we that managed to talk our way out of that. I wish I wouldn't be so fucking retarded. Can't believe we called wow. Leia. What a m fucking muppet. You know, if there is a rebellion in the future, they're not going to have any problems at all. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Alright, take care, guys. You have a nice day. You have a nice day. The whole time I've known you, you've been hiding something. 
Oh, shut up. Yeah, you just met and he's a fucking oh, Jedi. Leia. This is the most shallow shit. Do you think they mean anything other than what father. they're saying here? It's you like, hey, here are, my, here are the feelings that I'm I supposed wish to I be could conveying. Say I was. You knew her. My real mother. Are you my real father? I wish I could say I was. But no, I'm not. Sometimes I try to imagine what he was like. It's really oh, quiet on the back that, of this thing. Are they suggesting he's hiding the fact that her father is Anakin or Vader? I assume they're also doing like the they're they're drawing parallels to Padme. I swear to God, they better not have that be revealed to her. The Jedi were taken from our families when we were very young. There's still someone that likes the Empire in the vehicle. My mother's shawl. Just saying. Yeah. Well, it's I it's not super. Hey, it it's not super quiet in the back of this open topped thing. So it's fine. <laughs> if he's not in frame, he doesn't exist. Mm, That's true. Fine. Fair, fair enough. I wish that. Leia, isn't it crazy that we're on the run? He's like, what'd you say there, partner? I, Jedi, <laughs> I meant Lola. I meant Lola, Loba. Yes, I meant Lo 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 Lorba. Lo <laughs> I went Lumbo. I went Hulu. I don't, oh, standard more. inspector. Now find his lightsaber, surely, right? Well, yeah, then he'd be done. Hide he's it already now, done. Hide it now, he hide should it be now. done already, so it doesn't fucking matter, I guess. Remember why he's on this transport? It's just because he refused to say no to Leia when. Well, you refused to wait for his actual contact. The child is getting on. I better get on, too. A couple of strays I found. Oh Thought shit, he's evil. Check them out. All right, thanks, Frank. It doesn't um, matter. Why are you putting your hood up? At this point, they're gonna want to see your face or whatever. I tried the hood earlier. That makes you look more suspicious. <laughs> yep. Not a hey, you look like a Jedi. The outpost today. Where are you headed? Uh, back to Tall. We have family here. We were visiting. All right, step out of the vehicle. Initiate protocol twenty three. How long until this is over? They should have been caught ten times by now. I'm sure the oh, I'm sure these stormtroopers will be dead in no time. Oh yeah, I don't think they're gonna be shit. What stormtroopers are never shit. <laughs> I'd be happy to see Obi Wan beat some stormtroopers. Okay, yeah, it's right? over. There's no fucking way now. <laughs> Literal probe droid. Probe him, probe droid. Put a thing probe up his. Uh... Oh no. I said raise your head. Let's you mean do it. Well. as well. Delaying it only makes it worse. <laughs> oh, he's reaching for. They his can gun. see you reaching for that. Yeah, okay, what are so they doing? They both would have shot him when he did that, but never mind. It's one on the tower, like all the way up there. It's like a clear shot. No, oh, I, wow! He didn't do yeah, it. I don't, wow. feel, I don't feel that tactic, to be honest. Oh. Holy oh. fuck! Why? Man. That's okay. the most violent thing they've ever shown. Also, I'm gonna be honest, yeah, I'm not comfortable with him using a meat shield for a guy who did not know he was evil. I, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. I am not okay with that, Obi Wan. I, I, I think that's the only reason that they established he was like pro Empire. So yeah, but, yeah, but Obi Wan didn't know that. Let the go. You know know that. Holy shit! Jesus. What? I, did that just happen? That is insanely irresponsible. You could have killed her. You could have easily well, hang, killed what? her. Just use the force to stop him pulling the trigger, you filthy cowboy Jesus looking fuck. I don't know, man. Just walk around the hill. Walk oh, around the hill. Shoot them, shoot them, shoot, 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 maybe shoot them now! The Anyone, there's three. What? You do, do have a lightsaber, my dude. Oh, you can he has the like, force. He killed five. He's still the gun. They haven't made him drop the gun. Uh, he killed five. This is three. He still has the gun. What is happening? Oh, she's, she's probably gonna, gonna save them. The he's still he's gonna the gun. Save them. Yeah. Yeah. Why is oh. that happening? I'm the spy. <laughs> I'm the spy. <laughs> I'm the spy. The the Man, thanks for not meeting me out there in the field. Well, then again, he could have waited. I mean, he wasn't like, waiting. He, he like, literally yeah. didn't wait more than a minute. Seconds. Seconds. And then she and managed to get ahead of all of this him. to save him. That's incredible. He destroyed the probes. It's not hard. It's one blaster bolt. Not Puso. It's a mining planet. Mid-rim type 2. Okay, thanks for the I can't believe this shit, man. All that's so garbage. I'll inform Lord Vader. He's already been informed. He was most appreciative. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's so <laughs> funny. <laughs> most appreciative. He was most appreciative. She should say, like, do you ever realize what you're wearing? It's like, do you, you know you know talk like that? that? You talk your like hat. this when you're Nobody alone. Nobody wants to say anything. Nobody wants to say anything about your hat. <laughs> but, like, but I will. <laughs> I will. Do you Look keep things in that hat? It's not raining. <laughs> it's not raining. <laughs> 
All right, so all of that was stupid, but at least now this is happening. I was on my way when the probes arrived, but you'd already gone. I hadn't expected anyone to come. Yeah, good job, Obi Wan. Had you just stayed there, you could have avoided all that. I can get you to the port. There's a pilot who's agreed to take you, but he's not scheduled to leave for a few hours, so we need to lay low. Wait here. Scheduled or scheduled in Star Wars? It's a scheduled in Star Wars. I mean, she's compromised, right? They would have known that she went out with. Yeah, yeah. Hickory is done. It's annoying. It's weird that you just have an officer, Harry hanging out alone that's weird especially when she's doing suspicious things like yeah. you know, looking like, around and... there's gary and jeff <laughs> so, you know, you know. nobody cares about stormtroopers it doesn't matter yeah they're no, not people right we'll make it out i didn't do it huh? i didn't mean to run away he's pissed herself I used to huh? do it all the time. oh wow they're giving it this now it wasn't your fault it's man. weird that this hits here that's yeah. i was about to say that came out of nowhere this is something you should have started earlier it's like they forgot in the last episode. Are your yeah. eyes red? See, this no, is closer to what she should have been like in episode two. Congratulations, show. You finally figured out an element of how she should feel. I'm just going to forget. Look the more next suspicious. I, know, right? I mean, you might as well put your hood on, dude. Like, <laughs> at this point. No, look, it's so conspicuous. Just walk ridiculous. like normal people. Oh. Can you imagine if someone just walked past and they're like, what are you just sort of hiding here in this little alleyway? What are you doing, buddy? At least try and pillage some of that stormtrooper armor from the many bodies you've freshly created. That way you can freely move about with the undercover lady escorting your prisoner to wherever you may need to go. So much better than this utterly sus shit. It's all right. He's on our side. Designation's Ned B. Hi, Ned B. This is L0 LA59. Lola, say hello. Uh, he's, he's just a loader. They don't allow them to communicate. What? But what if he has something to what, say? But what if you have to tell the loader to load something? Yeah, why wouldn't or to you unload want them to something? communicate? That's just handy. Yeah, it seems like, yeah, yeah like, something very useful. I, uh, you can't, can't even over here. I want to follow this guy's life. I'm way more interested in this yeah. story. What he's up to. She said they don't allow them what to communicate. That's so strange. Like, why would you not yeah, allow them to communicate? They're capable of it. Yeah, safe houses like this throughout the galaxy. Some call it the path. You're not the first Jedi to come through here. It all leads to Jabim. From there, we give them new identities and get them out. There's a lot of good people risking their lives out there. Are they all Jedi? Not all. These days, the Empire hunts anyone who's force sensitive. Oh, so it's not the Jedi. Oh, it's just force sensitive Even people. Okay. Even children. What do you mean, even children? They did that already back in the prequel here. We're not sure. What happens to them? We're not sure. No one ever sees them again. Right, because they have become inquisitors. Or they die. Or they die, yeah. Surely, more sensitive to Oh, wow. Viper rare. Smuggling younglings. Wait, who was mentioned, sorry? Winland? Was that the guy from the other planet? I forgot already what his name was. Don't worry, Metal, I've got you covered. Meme repository, I'll take it from here. Quinlan Voss, fan favorite character, best known for his appearances in the old Star Wars Republic and Jedi comics. A morally ambiguous character, often struggling with the dark side of the Force and possessing certain unique Force abilities. Well, unique until Rey stole them. Initially, he was slated to die in Episode 3 during Order 66, but the scene was never filmed, so Quinlan lives another day, free for Disney need to rub their bulbous greasy cocks all over thanks george can you truly see see what <laughs> shut up <laughs> stop talking Go stop away. talking stop giving her lines the way. follow me i'll know the way yeah if only your robot could communicate <laughs> yeah <laughs> everything is fine just open up the door yeah there's I no reason not to open it this must be something you've accounted for right you went through a secret door back there you're fine yeah, just open up the door. Hello, I'm just a loader, loading, as I do. Hello, I'm Ned. You want some loads? I mean, is he gonna kill him? Loads? No, please leave my yeah, house. Yeah, sure. Uh, a Jedi was seen entering this camp. Oh, someone did spot him. Man, if only he'd switched fucking clothing by now. Shaved all his hair hood. off, you know? I have the hood on. Seen Might anyone? as well. Seen anyone? <laughs> Can't talk. Hey! I'm talking to you. <laughs> just stand there. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. You. Uh, he can see you with the hammer. It's just a loader. It doesn't understand. Why did you take so long to say that, other stormtrooper? Was it for the tension? Yeah. It's he walks by robot, Why are you got like a hammer on you? Why yeah, wouldn't you know? Why, why wouldn't they know that? It? Why don't they know that? Surely they would. <sighs> wouldn't they be trained in all of these things as a stormtrooper? Well, they, they work oh, here. Like they work here in yeah. this town. They don't know that. This droid hates the Empire. Hey, to us, it was better. Congratulations. You are being rescued. Someone 
must have seen us. Yeah, crazy, huh? Yeah, because yeah, you were in that uniform. You and... literally put no effort into being hidden, and someone saw you. No, they won't, Shadily. That helps. You're like an officer. People will really recognize you, right? I wear it on the other side. It gives me a faster draw. Can you teach me how to shoot? No. Not now. Yeah. I'll get it because she's going to shoot one day. Because you'll make a good fighter one day. No, Why? Yeah, 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 there you go. Yes, yeah, I think yeah. you might be right. Oh, fuck. Uh, Jesus, calm uh, down. Why, why would you say why that? You because it is well, true, it, Rand. It's just because it's the meta. Like, that's the thing. Yeah, They I needed know, the load a robot to say, you know what, I think you're both right. And someone else, a fourth person. Also, why would you let people write messages and names on the inside? If this place gets discovered, now they have yep. a record of all the people yeah. who've come through here. So that's probably not too great. Yeah, Kenobi should be incredibly thankful out. for this woman. She's facilitated everything yeah. for him. God damn. She's so helpful. He's been fucking useless on his own. And considering that she wouldn't have even needed to compromise everything if he had just waited another few minutes. Yep, that everything would have been fine. Up. What's going on with him now? Oh, Vader. Is this Sensing Anakin's oh, flames. Oh, it's dark now. Wait, when was it nighttime? <laughs> uh, what the fuck? Well, the sun sets very fast on this planet, Mark. Okay. Blink and you'll miss it. Oh, boy. Ah, leave, leave, leave. Oh, it's the You got it. Uh, the uh, leave. Ah, yeah. I guess probably don't remember. Vader has that breath in the originals too. Oh, so cool. okay, okay, okay. It's good to know. Leave. You need to leave. Yeah, you so need you to need to run. Need to leave. Run yeah. the fuck, fuck away. Off. If you can sense him, he can sense you. Yeah. Oh, no, Darth Vader's mission is based on movement. Just when we were complimenting him. And then how it's gonna go she... red. It's about to go red, isn't it? Mm-hmm. There's the lightsaber. Oh, no, maybe not yet. Oh, wow. They showed a tiny, minuscule amount of restraint. Well, the not fact playing that he's wearing his helmet. <laughs> I'm just surprised they're not playing the Imperial March, like, at all. No, no, both of you go. Why do? You, why are you looking at him? He's coming towards you. You don't want Darth Vader Leave. to come towards you. Leave. Obi Wan, I can see you. I, I can smell you. Are you getting grounded <laughs> by time? Is that the play? Yeah, oh, it's over. He knows. Okay. Uh, He's gonna do this to lure him out. Obi Wan, you need to make a fucking decision, man. Uh oh! You just kill him? Yeah. Uh, oh, he just kills people. He's hey, cool, evil. Everyone. Real cool. This is evil. Darth Vader's just super evil. Go, leave. That wasn't even like. Right you. you should make him scream. That's what Vader would have done. Yeah, if you just kill him instantly. I'll be, I'll be right behind you. Get it on. Promise me. Obi Wan. Like, oh, Obi Wan. Remember, you have a mission with Luke as well. <laughs> no, remember? That's fine. Yoda told you. It's really important. So no, it's fine. Don't worry about it. What are you watching? Dead. Yeah, they're trying this to imply is... this is why Obi Wan has to stay, but oh, you shouldn't have been around died. to see any of this. It's just annoying that he's never thought that this is a potential, and this is happening all around the galaxy all the time. So. Mm -hmm. What What is he doing? Vader. He's just trying to bait out Kenobi, I guess. No, not Vader. What is yeah. Obi Wan doing? He's just, yeah, he's just, he's just waiting for people to die. He's 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 not going one way or the other, you know? He's just standing, allowing this to happen, but not doing anything. Would you sweep the town? Search for others. Oh, God. You so guys what have you been to... doing? Vader's here now. You guys need to stop. Oh, yeah. So all our family members were just casually killed for no reason at all. Yeah. We love oh. the Empire. They're great. Uh, I, I can just, see I how... I love casually murdering people for fucking no reason. <laughs> it's my favorite thing for bad guys to do, because it really makes me believe they're bad people, you know? However, could a sizable rebellion ever be formed? Why would that ever happen? I, I couldn't, can't imagine why that can <laughs> make any sense. Wait, what? Yeah. Uh, are you ahead? Where did you go? You went How did you here? do that? <laughs> oh, okay. Why are you out here? This genuinely is so incoherent that I feel like it's a vision, but I don't think it's going to be a vision. It, it has to be, right? How could he have caught up? Why would he be having a vision? <laughs> right now. Oh, he's just running away. Oh, you, what, why did you come out here then? <laughs> he's just <laughs> running away. What the, is he running back? I only no, run, but like, he, very, a jog. He like a jog. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Are you luring him onto a landmine or something? Run. 
Oh, is he ahead of you again? Is he flying to these places? <laughs> no, he's know. running really quick when the camera's not on him. It's really silly, but we don't show it. Oh, this is don't, annoying. Don't put that in front of your face. You're going to blind yourself. Nice that we finally pulled out the fucking lightsaber, though, eh? How about that? Don't run away again, you pussy. <laughs> you little coward. I wanted to do a brisk jog again. It was what so funny. Become? What have you become? I am. What you made me. Yeah, you can't really talk, Obi-Wan. You did that to him. <laughs> yeah, I kind of fucked him up, but pretty bad. <laughs> oh, really? You're running away! Are you Why? kidding me? What are you Why? doing? Oh, where are you fucking going? Hell. That's so Why are you touching their faces? Oh, they now bad. now they're going to start interrogating people. It's like, probably should have opened with that. Hey, what a bot. I need to talk to you. Yeah. He literally just came out of the place. Yeah, well, you know, they don't communicate very well. Yeah, whatever. You can just press open the, the door. like a normal of person. person. Of course she will find the correct place. Oh, this is so bad. You should be moving faster. They should be sprinting. Should be this is insane. Faster, yeah. You should be running. You just saw Darth motherfucking oh. Vader. You need to run. Nobody cares. What are we doing? Gives a shit. It's unreal. Vader and Obi-Wan just met, and it, it, he just jogged away twice. I, I, I can't <laughs> believe twice. we just saw that. It's Matt. Risk jog. Oh, here we go again. Is he going to pop up again? I'm so scared of Vader, also going but to not walking that scared. Seriously, how could he not comment on the fact that he keeps pussing out? Like, he has to. Where are you going? Why did you come out here if you're going to run? I really don't understand. Walking is awkward for me. Oh, okay. Ow, ow, oh, how? How? How did you speak up? Now we're doing this. Okay, you have fight oh, time. It. This is real. <laughs> this is happening. This is, this is happening. <laughs> oh man, that choreography. What was that? The uh, years have made you weak. Are you gonna... Uh, I feel like there just should have been like a conversation or it, something. Like, you have history? Or, is it just me? Does it seem like almost um, cheap yeah. or something? Something's not right. It, does. it, it feels it, very it feels cheap. Right right like, it came out of nowhere? Like, money. why would you look behind there? Doesn't feel like she we found built it. up to this fight. No, there wasn't any build-up. You're right. This, 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 this is Vader and Obi Wan. <laughs> this is like yeah. it's, oh, it's just it's now. so unceremonious. There's just nothing to this. They're just here. Wait, it's like on. they're cashing a check early. Wait, she's as soon as you put him in a scene, that's all you want to see. It's like really hard to come back from that. You have to be really careful how you use him. Because... Yeah, help him. Fine. Nope, he won't be. I can make it on my own from here. Go. Keep running till you reach the port. A pilot will meet you there. Okay. Bring him back. Wait, she's gonna go help. Wait, what? No. Obi help him? What? No, the run. Go with her. To get she needs to safety. An adult. This is so slow. This is a Jedi. The little girl needs what? your help. What the fuck? Why is this so? Oh, <laughs> this is terrible. The choreography. What? It, what's going do, on? Do we even need clips of Revenge of the Sith to show <laughs> the difference? And... Then. You should have killed me oh, he, when you he's had done. the chance. That's a generic line. Uh, fucking out again. Wow. Well, just walk through it, I guess. Well, well he has to, because like use the use the force to make the smoke duels. go away. You have telekinesis. Well, yeah, I guess they can't they can't have an end to their duel with one of them dying, so. Oh, okay. I can't believe she's found it. Well, she's about to bump she into the woman then, right? She just looked yeah. and found it. Unless there's multiple Oh, look at all these names. I swear to God, if she manages to catch up with uh. Leia and Leia's pilot, whoever that is, because of the stupid lady ditching them and walking there. Because I don't know what else this would be. Are you angry what because you saw a symbol? Oh, God, Man, please like don't. Wow. Don't You're you dare. pressing all the right buttons. 
You have like eagle vision or that, that, in, inspector vision from a video have game. Eagle vision from Assassin's Creed. It's like, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. That is the button. That That's the that thing. Right, uh, the door. That right is getting closer and closer to getting that. She's gonna get Laris. She's so fucking dumb. Don't you dare. Oh, good. Obi Wan seems like such a pussy. Oh, what's that? Okay. The, oh, the rocks. Use force on him. Back. Do something. Just yeah, well, yeah try doing something. You, you can't just do that. That's cheating. Try and do, try and do something, Obi Wan. It does seem like this is an oh. unspoken rule. You're not really yeah, like no, allowed they, to do. We've talked about this. <laughs> like you can't, you can't do this because it, it's, it's, it's like the hyperdrive kamikaze. You can't do this. Just to really emphasize the problem with this scene, let's jump into Jedi Academy. So we got Rose here. She, she doesn't have any force on her. So we're just gonna just do, do an old choke, do an old choke maneuver there. Oh, oh, sorry, Rose. Oh. Oh no! Oh nuts! Oh no! Whatever will we do? Oh but now! Oh oh no! Obi Wan's here! What are we gonna do? Oh no! I'm gonna do it to him now! Oh! Oh no! Obi Wan can't be gripped because he has the Force too. So you see, game developers have to actually deal with the fucking bullshit that writers put on screen because otherwise lightsaber duels wouldn't function. So they have to figure out, okay, so we want to give them force grip, but we also want to give them lightsabers. And we want them to actually use the lightsabers. So what do we do? Uh, oh, I know. Anytime you try to force grip someone, you have the ability to break out of it using the force because that would actually make sense. So Obi-Wan, fucking break out of your fucking grip, man. Use your fucking force powers. You've been training, right? You need to train Luke. So fucking do Use that thing that you should have been practicing and break free. Break free. Or he'll do this. Oh, those why? are flammable. Why? Now you oh, can't walk to him. I want to burn him as well. Now you will suffer, Obi-Wan. Obi-Wan. Oh, so he's going to be hideously scarred now. Well, I mean, use we the force, Obi-Wan. I'm, I'm, well, he I'm, can't. He's, he's, wait, sorry. He's no so good at it. Are the writers not familiar with what fire is? No, no, apparently not. Your pain has just begun. It, it, you don't. Why are you such a loser? Do they not know what fire Do does? Do something. How did she get out here without? How the other did one she? Finding her? Well, no, they do know what fire does. There's a big, there's a big guy standing no, there. No, why did you? He shows you, exactly what fire does. That's not what. That's. that's no, that's bullshit. not how this works. Is she gonna save him? I like that Beta didn't even Wait, you know where, where it came, came from. from! That's the downside of blasters, is you know where all this shit Oh, great, more fire. Well, that doesn't matter. Vader just put it out with the force. Just put it out again. Yeah, just put it out again. Wait, the droid put is it out. Now. Use put the it force out. and stop it. No, the loader bot's gonna save him. Put it out. Put Use the, the force out. and just stop him. Just, just put it out with Vader. the force. What are you yeah. doing? Vader? Put it out. Vader? Put it out. Use the force and grab the robot. Why are you watching go away? Wake up. Vader. Stop him. Vader, Vader, just, Vader, just, just walk Vader around. Is what is Vader doing? Vader is, Vader is, Vader is currently suffering. having war flashbacks. <laughs> <What> <laughs> He's having PTSD from the fire this time. He has to re-roll every time oh, and he sweet. failed his roll this Vader's time. Vader's retarded too. Are you just letting him go? Yep. Oh, you're leaving? You're fucking off. No, just walk around. Get him. Well, what He's about? What? What? Every, what? Other, every other time that Obi-Wan sorry, sorry, ran I'm, into a I'm brisk like... jog. I'm. They lost him. They lost what him. Is they lost him. They lost him. What is going on? He had help where to sweep the planet. No, we'll never find him. We've no, no, he's him. here. Just get a ship. Call yeah. your ships and your probe yeah, droids. He's here ship. on the planet. He's just right over there. He must have carried him twenty feet. How did you get away? Wait, How did Leia? she get away? Where's Leia? Where is, where is Leia? Leia? Yeah. Is she still? She's still escaping. Oh, and what's what's, what's it gonna be? Gonna catch up with her. Wait, is she coming back? Yeah, she's gonna be coming. Yep. There you go. Yay, oh, come, they did it. What? Excellent writing. I Top don't... notch. 110%. Beautiful. Unfortunately, they couldn't make it, but... Impossible, I mean, but whatever. She... How did she get here? Killed the pilot. Great. How... How is it even possible that she made it there ahead of her? Without... Isn't it... Oh, God. Oh, such she good writing. Oh, Dude, wow. wow. What in the God. God. Written by four God. people. Four people wrote this. It took four people. Dude. It took four people, and this is what we Stop have. Stop saying it's based on I, Star Wars by George Lucas. I, it's a lie. 
I'm what actually a... like I'm actually struggling. Wow. To, like how did... I'm I'm really that struggling was here. Shit. Like I'm really struggling. Where do you begin? Like, off a cliff. Like okay, oh. <laughs> genuinely, genuine question. Can any, does anyone have any suggestions of how to make that worse without going into anything like conspicuously outside the realm of something they would do? I don't know, because like I'm not even sure that we're obeying the laws of like where things are in space, you know? Like yeah. characters are where they can't be. Like right? Exclude, exclude one tunnel. How did I've been running through that fucking tunnel system for like half an hour before Reva even opened the door. How the hell did she get there ahead of them? Yeah. Oh, James Earl Jones, sense. there you go. Yeah. Bullshit. Yeah, of course it was him. Yeah, well, it, it, to be fair, it might not even be him. It could be fucking I figured robot. It could... Hey guys, here's a short demo of our voice conversion technology. We'll be converting my voice to the voice of Barack Obama. The system captures the idiosyncrasies of how I say something. Each time I say it, I can say the same thing many times. The same thing many times. The same thing many times. And each time the recording will be correspondingly different. This makes voice conversion suitable for applications where the results should have the personality and range to emotion of a real person. Let me help you. Have you heard anyone talk like that back home? The voice was fine with me this the the stupid i'm just gonna break people's necks until Ko kenobi wakes up was lame and then him just well, I like gotta say, but... and then kenobi didn't even show up he had to go it, like just ran the fuck away what else. is supposed to be like the dramatic meeting of these two people i haven't seen each other for a decade who are probably the most important people to each other in terms of their effect on their lives kind of lands with a bit of a like a wet half on the thought Chris like, Joe's meeting i don't yeah, I don't know if you could have bungled that more. Is it, and what's their meeting place? It's like a, a weird it's yard just some, where there's... It's, oh, some this is yard. where the end of Crisis on Infinite Earth was. Exactly. It's the same place. <laughs> yeah. It's a fucking a bit, quarry. Yeah. Why are they it's having a dirt like, pile outside of Toronto I mean, or the fight quarry. Itself is, uh, the fight itself is pretty lame. It was terrible. They should have, I don't even know if they should have fought. This should have been just like, wow, I can't. Probably we're meeting. Have fought. I we're think, meeting. Um, I'm sorry. Have, I've I been thinking about what for the last. Can 10 you really call years. this fight like like what was choreographed here? Like I don't know. I don't know what this, that was. This well, maybe is... they didn't have time to choreograph it, and they just you know on the. Oh, didn't wasn't it like Hayden Christensen practicing? We are bringing back Hayden Christensen to reprise the role of Darth Vader. We couldn't tell the story of Obi Wan Kenobi without addressing Anakin or Vader. Have another swing at each other it might be quite uh, satisfying for everybody. Well, so so this is fight one done. As far as we know, there's three of them. There'll be another one. Well, there's definitely going to be one more. There's definitely one more. Right say, yeah. I guess it's I like... just um, it's really odd that you would think that the big shtick of this show, which is essentially that you want to have this meeting, it, I don't know. This show is fast sinking into. You know how, like I say with Solo, I don't believe, like when I watch A New Hope, that Han Solo dropped Cthulhu into a black no, hole. Yeah, like yeah. I'm kind of, I'm kind of very quickly reaching that here. I'm like, I don't believe this happened. Yeah. I believe that he lived on Tatooine for 19 years and an uneventful life, and then he met, or he met Darth Vader for the first time again on the Death Star. Like yeah, I'm he fast knew, getting to that point. Knew the because man, we have made Kenobi like, like I said, super cowardly, super incompetent. Yeah. They know what they're doing, Leia. Just, he can't critically think to save his fucking life. It's gone and insane. I'm, okay with him. I'm totally fine with him not being as adept a fighter or as uh, good with the Force now, but like he shouldn't, be years, losing, yeah. he shouldn't be losing like the years and years I and need... years of experience that he developed in the Clone Wars, yeah. in all of his years as a Jedi Master. He was a Jedi Master. He was yeah. good enough well, to was, beat all like, of those he beat people. Darth he Maul. beat Grievous, he beat Darth Maul, he beat, Maul. He beat Anakin. He did pretty much beat Count Dooku. Dooku, yeah. Grievous. This is the thing, we're talking about Anakin, you're right. Like one of the best him. swordsmen <laughs> ever. But but this is just something he's casually for the swordsmanship in that fucking scene. So what are we thing. doing? Like, Both of them are just does, idiots. Does it even make sense? Like if he's been given this mission to protect Luke, do I are we to believe that he wouldn't keep training just in case? I dude, I, I agree with you. I hate the fact that not everything is sort of as a prism viewed from his potential to help Luke. Like every question that comes well, up in this adventure should be filtered through that. Like if I do this, I well, might not be able to protect me. Luke. Yeah, I still have Yoda a job told to do. Him, like Yoda told him yeah. that this was so important. Destroy the Sith. We must. Hidden, safe. The children must be kept. We must take them somewhere where the Sith will not sense their presence. To Tatooine, do his family send him? I will take the child and watch over him. 
Yoda told him to spend like the next several like years learning what? about you know force ghosts and everything. In your solitude on Tatooine, training I have for you. An old friend has learned the path to immortality. How to commune with him, I will teach you. Yeah. Yoda told him about Qui Gon Jinn. Why the fuck is his I'm, force turned off? I still don't feel justified I'm, that we've had that explained. I'm fine with him having doubts. I want him to have doubts. That's I want not him the same thing, though, is it? No, no, no. That's that's what I'm saying. Is like I, I want, want this story to be about him having doubts about like whether what, his mission will bring about anything, what his failures were. But like that doesn't mean you have to completely turn him into an entirely incompetent, basically a different person. Like, like, I just don't even see... I don't... Well, if, I don't yeah, see this is not Obi-Wan. I was gonna say, what do we have that yeah. is Obi-Wan's here? It's Ewan McGregor, that is it. The actor. Ewan McGregor. It's the actor. Because I don't, I don't see the traits of him in the prequel era, and I don't see his traits in the OT, and it's like, well, it's the middle story. But surely he's gonna have, like, a mix at this point. He's getting there. Yeah. Or is or, this the story that will teleport him to... Alec McGuinness, like Obi Wan, is you know what I mean? Like, is this the one that's just going to teleport him to those traits? He'll learn so much, and he'll be there, and then there'll be no more tra tr like drama for the next nine years until Darth Maul shows up. I'm and they still fight again pissed off that they're making him wear his fucking robe. Like, it's insane that he, it's he because they want wear to something robe. normal. Like yeah, that's the, the whole reason they're doing it is because it makes the audience connect like with their monkey brain. Like, that's Kenobi. That's Kenobi. Well, he looks so awesome. Oh, my bones are aching. Well, which is pretty crazy when you think about the fact that him lighting up his lightsaber, they didn't put much, uh... No, it's they so they casual! Much, uh, no, yeah, yeah, it was just completely really casual. casual. That's why I thought they were holding off on it last episode. I thought that they didn't have him meet Reva just so that they could wait for the reveal of him turning on his lightsaber. Well, the, and then halfway through this scene, it's like, oh, it's on, I guess, okay. The way you do payoffs like that is that he's... It's like the Force one, right? But I just don't believe he should have turned off the Force. Well, he's in a position where he's, op he's used every other option and he's gotta do it. But, but yeah. to be fair, I only find that meaningful if he hasn't turned it on up to this point for a really good reason. But I haven't been given that reason. I, don't I didn't know. know that Jedi could bleed. I don't know why he's not but doing he all went... these different things. He's, he's running these really complicated and dangerous adventures, but he refuses to use his two greatest tools. He just ran out to this dirt pile so that he <sighs> could, I guess, see Darth Vader? I don't know why he went out there to, to look at him or to, to run away from him again. So I... What a joke. I hate the fact that he keeps is fucking running away from Vader. Like, yeah. you should have words for each other. Like, this should be oh God, end so of right. season. You have a whole conversation. conversation Obi Wan, I've been thinking yeah. about this for God, ten fucking you, years. You we have. Me off. I'm gonna put you in the fire. <laughs> now you know. How yeah, that's what I mean. It's so basic, bitch. <laughs> like when you have these two talk to each other, you get like five sentences per scene. You get about three scenes. Like, what are we gonna spend it on? I know. You should have killed me when you had the chads. <laughs> hey, off, right which in. is a line that should exist in part of a much, much larger it conversation. Be, it should be something that we say is what Vader thinks as a result of all the other things he's saying. You should be able to pick it all up. These are all the obvious fucking things. Well, like, for example, after... let's have a line of him saying, I hate you. It's like, no, 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 no. We wouldn't need that either. We want, we want things said that are really insightful, meaningful for the two of them to actually say, this is your chance. You're ruining it. Our yeah. season's well, second act low point is maybe, if you want to have them meet sooner, the season's second act low point is Vader has sort of tracked Obi-Wan down and they're in close proximity. Vader then starts talking aloud about like he does with Luke. You cannot hide forever, Luke. Give yourself to the dark side. It is the only way you can save your friends. I'm gonna, yeah. He's going to start talking aloud about what he did during Order 66 in the Jedi Temple, and it makes Obi-Wan angry. Obi-Wan gets upset, and he goes out there, and he's angry, and he fights him, and he barely gets away, and that's our low point, because he kind of gave can, in to his well, emotions. He could talk about he all the people who died as a result exactly. of Obi-Wan yeah. going into that's, exile. Well, remember in, uh, in, in Return of the Jedi. Yes. Your thoughts betray you. 
Your feelings for them are strong, especially for sister. That's how he lures Luke out. So, you have a twin sister. Your feelings have now betrayed her too. He exactly, that's the we, like, That's Vader. Uh, you know, Obi-Wan was wise to hide her from me. Now his failure is complete. Vader's so you much imagine, cooler you and smarter and badass that he is in this. If you will not turn to the dark side, then perhaps she will. Ah! He's like, you should have seen Mace Windu. He was screaming like a bitch as he went flying out that window or something. You know, just saying things to. Have you ever wondered what really happened angry. to uh, what's her face, Ahsoka here? Here, you know, like I, I find out something like that. Get, get Obi Wan to become emotional and angry. Draw him out. Obi Wan kind of gives like, into that dark can, part of himself, and he has to learn to find his way, despite all of the guilt he might feel inside of him and all the bad things that have happened. He has to stay focused on the future. Focus Focused on his mission, on on getting Luke on the path. It's not all over, and you have to live to fight another day. You can have him. But we got point this. Out that several of the Jedi that have been hunted down over the decade, a lot of them, when interrogated, when brought to their last limits, they are desperate for you, and you abandoned yeah. them. Yeah, and you weren't there. Why? And then you could be like, "Cause you fear me." And like Obi Wan yeah. could be like, "I don't even." Cause this is the thing. In, in our version, Obi Wan knows Vader exists. <laughs> That's not a yes. like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> This isn't a surprise. In it's fact, not he's fair. Probably prepared, he's probably prepared for this day, just, you know, like many times. Vader right definitely after. has. Well, both of them. Why wouldn't they have a conversation? Why isn't it, I'm going to put you in the fire. Now I don't like you. Vader. And then Obi-Wan runs away. Uh, like, oh, terrible. Uh, yeah, Awful. I always wondered if I'd see you again then, yeah, th or <laughs> something. Something, something. I got something. Something between these two. You totally have bungled one of the best potential payoffs that the story could have and it's it's all just you've wasted it thoroughly wasted it completely and then, and it, wasted. i was gonna make was you bid so like you made me bid it's so but like Childish. the focus on this it just ignores everything else that happens in that episode yes we are in this field oh damn yeah, it was yeah. a lie Let's not wait. Let's go talk to this oh, chap God, and yeah, get on yeah. his pod. Don't say anything. Oh, feel free to speak freely with this stranger. Yes, let's get on the barge. Oh, no. Imperial <laughs> troopers. Stormtroopers are here. What are we going to say? Oh, whoops. Your name's not Leia. Wait, that's that's her mom. Yeah, that's. I get him mm. confused. <laughs> I'm not Obi-Wan. <laughs> like, what? The, what are we no, doing? He isn't Obi-Wan. Episode 3 was so much worse than 2, which was so much worse than 1. They can't That's construct. Oh, I can't wait for four. They can't construct one event leading to the next to save their lives. <laughs> no, There's not a they fucking can't. component of this that makes like any. It's like, oh, I see how that works. It's like, no, fucking Obi Wan is like, well, why are they here? I don't understand how a person could not be in this exact location. Let's get on this truck and be stupid for twenty minutes. Like, <laughs> like I, I guess, it, I guess it makes sense. The, the guy truck that was truck. going and then it got yeah, to the I, place. That I, makes sense. I still take but major like, issue with the meat shield. That bothers me to know. Yeah. Any. Oh, he yeah, didn't yeah. know that he ratted him out, and even if he did, and even no, I, he I didn't even rat him out. He's just like, I found some weird people. Can you check him out? It's not even ratting him out. It's just like these are yeah. basically police officers. I found yeah, these kind of random like, people some strays, in a field. All. Like, can it's you check him out? I think, well, yeah, can I you think, blame I think him? it's trying to. Uh, I think it's trying to. I think that they're trying to justify it with, "Hey, he liked the Empire, so it's fine." So it's okay to use him as a human shield. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't I don't even believe that's something like a Jedi would do, just ever. No. Really. It feels yeah. so out of character and so out of out of order, oh. dare I say. Uh, it's that, that it's, it's guy's gonna wake to up. Also, also like, if total lack of well, what they needed to do was have the guy try to hit him with like a wrench or something. Yeah. And then Kenobi blocks yeah, it, flips you... him around. That's what you instead the guy is like, oh no, uh, leave me like he, he looks yeah. panicked and yeah. Kenobi uses him in shield. It's it's not the right. Fact that he turns well, like, off the, the well. little like uh, gate to like get through the laser it's, gate when he yeah, that was so around. funny. And then funny as fuck. The stormtroopers show up and it's like, dude, you're a Jedi. You have a lightsaber. You could like fight three stormtroopers. Come on. He took out yeah. five of them and a probe droid, which probe droids can really shoot not. you. So, so there's six enemies, and then he can't take on three. You can argue four with the girl in the back. And they let him I keep his gun when he goes down on his mm -hmm. knee. It's like when the other guy captures Leia, he's like, drop it, and then he just shoots the dude. <laughs> it's like, what yeah. was that? What's the point of like, a, yeah, drop the gun, I gotcha. Guess he didn't Wait. have it. 
I'm sorry, <laughs> but I've got this on screen right now. If this is the state of your prisoner, like, you might be like, spot the problem with this image. Is there anything here that maybe looks out of yeah, place? Yeah. <laughs> like, nah, it's got his finger on the trigger. <laughs> Especially when you have reason to believe that this is a Jedi, you know? It's like <laughs> I don't know why you just wouldn't Jedi. fucking shoot him instantly, you know? I don't like, know it's why they wouldn't shoot like, him instantly, yeah. Like, like the, look, those are your those are your friends who were dead back there. In like, Order dude. 66, they didn't wait around. They weren't like, surrender. They just started shooting. Oh, God. Also, what a there's mess. a mess. Nobi One doesn't use the Force in this episode when I feel like in no, these situations, is. having this kind of power he, is very good, you especially use it when if desperate. you're. Dude, I wouldn't be surprised if at the end of the episode six he cracks it back open, speaks to Obi Wan, Luke is safe, Leia's safe. That's how it ends. Sorry, speaks. To, yeah, Qui Gon, man. Uh, the, the he, like the I wouldn't be surprised if the fucking last episode episode has like Yoda and Qui Gon in it. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised. I think Qui Gon isn't a certainty. I think you'll only you'll only see Qui Gon when he's like. I think it'll be symbolic of him like coming through his depression. Episode five. It'll be episode five. At the end of episode five, he'll give him a pep talk and be like, "It's like okay, that second act low point." You just gotta try again, and then it'll be like, "Thanks, Qui Gon, for helping me out." And then Qui Gon will be like, "Yeah, no worries. It's what I do. I'm not up to anything Ooh. else, really. My timetable is but, um, wide open." You know, roll back even two or three years, you'll find footage of us talking about this show, and then how, oh god, seeing Vader and Kenobi back together doing things, like, oh, so risky. And it's just like, well, he has realized. Yeah, <laughs> I well, so. I mean, it's, it's, Again. Uh, it's retroactively damaging Obi-Wan, Darth Vader as well, like, he just let him escape, just let him leave. Yep, why not? How did, what's her name, escape as well? She shot them from the top, and it's like, I guess they none just of the stormtroopers ran they, up there. Yeah, so they she shoots care. once, and none of them can figure out the direction they it came around. from, even though they saw the bolt, so they would have seen exactly, like, you can guess, like, oh, there's a hill there, she's probably behind yeah. the fucking hill. Yeah, we should go get her, or else comes she'll out, shoot us too. And they still don't know where she is, fire, yeah. and they don't chase what we do, guys. Oh my just, god! It's just, it's, shooting, it's, it's just start start shooting into the fire where Obi Wan. Think about was. this. Like, if he didn't do the fire thing, he couldn't have escaped. There would have been yeah. no way. Nothing would have caught on fire. There would have been nothing. But then, then again, like Darth Vader, you you have the force. Just jump over that shit. Like, it, it seems weird it to be like that he did can, before. The stuff is smoldering, and she sets it back on fire. It's like, how does that happen? I don't understand <laughs> how that works. And why don't you just put it out again? Yeah, you couldn't yeah. put it out there the first time. <laughs> He just decides to let Obi Wan escape because he, he wants him to feel around his and pain. Wait, why are they? They get full control over the set piece and they make it retarded. Like, why would you do this? Why, with all of your freedoms, do you make it this way? And then we this have is to what just... you envisioned. Like in your head when you thought about this moment, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? This is what was in your head. This is what your mind came up with. But Rags, we got a really cool visual of Vader behind fire. Wow. It that's really great, because I couldn't, because when I saw that visual, all I was thinking of, like, why it wasn't it, why isn't he putting idiot. it out? He could probably just walk through it. Symbolizes how they're burning his character. <laughs> Obi-Wan, you gave me Bernie Bernie hot touch, I'm gonna do it to you now, hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> oh. Fuck you, show. <laughs> I can tell this one made you upset. It's Vader, leave him alone. This sucks. Yeah. They haven't like, done I, him I, yet. I, did you like the part we... where Obi Wan watched them? I swear to God. And yeah, and he didn't react them. to it in any that way. Well, he he didn't even have like an emotion on his face. But the, the problem with that scene is that they try to make it out as though it's like you have a choice: run with Leia to get out of here, or fend off Vader to increase his survival chances. And it's the worst of both worlds. He walks off like idiotically. He doesn't help any of the civilians. Then he gets caught and incapacitated by Vader while Leia is caught. All of the worst things happen. Just pretty riddled from top to bottom with terrible writing. We get Fucking terrible. Well, Muller's right. This is the worst of all worlds. This is the the, <laughs> the of in the in the infinite multiverse of bad shows. We just got the worst one. And already, I, I see. No. This is the longest of our three recordings. And they're only gonna get longer. <laughs> yeah, it's just gonna get fucking worse, dude. More it's and more just... annoying. And um, can I just say, special shout out to Rogue One. You had Darth Vader in it, and if anything, some of that shit was really cool. Yeah. Yeah, was... that was that was legit cool. Yeah, he was, was he was in character, and he did things that Vader would do. He did Don't be too proud of this technological terror you've constructed. The ability to destroy a planet is insignificant next to the power of the Force. Its power to create problems has certainly been confirmed. A city destroyed. An Imperial facility openly attacked. Apology accepted, Captain Nida. <laughs> 
careful not to choke on your aspirations, director. You didn't just like, ugh. They like they, they, I would they, kill they, if they just they, made a load of rogue ones. You know, stuff, stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, I can't believe we're wishing for the world where we did. They just made a bunch of Rogue One level stuff. <laughs> I'm Star Wars would probably be in like a relatively healthy place. We'd be saying, you know, there's nothing like as it's outstanding as the original, but like you know, it's, it's fine. Just, They're doing like, some stuff, and it's it's enjoyable. Because here it's just pain. It is pain. It's like I'm you're being dragged the, through fire in a dirt pile. You know pile. something worse. You want to know something worse? Well, that doesn't do much, Rag, so don't worry about it. You'll be fine. Oh, okay. You want to know, you want to know something, something that will upset you guys even a little bit more? All right, go for go it. I, I was like, I went to Twitter right away, and I, um, oh, I no. decided to, you know, share yeah. my immediate take, as I generally do with these episodes. <laughs> yeah. And I thought that the appropriate way to do it with this one would be to tweet out pictures from the episode and say, people you who saw this episode without laughing derisively, why? <laughs> <laughs> um, and... <laughs> oh, I, I weren't even told I went in looking to hate it. People going, I, like, I don't know, like, it's it's got some problems, but, like, it's fine. It's like, and that's the overwhelming response. I, I, there are a few people who are like, yeah, it's really bad, I agree. But the overwhelming response is... It was a responses, functional episode. What are you talking like, about? Okay, Jim. <laughs> well, how, I couldn't how even read it all the way without I'm sad, now. How is functional the first word anyone thinks of to describe this? This, like, this episode is absolutely dysfunctional. It's riddled, to a degree, been said. To a, it's to a degree it's kind of insane. Yeah, The least functional things I've ever seen. You know, it, it's like, oh, we can't make him meet up with uh, the helping person. We've got to get some stressful, tension-filled scenes with other stuff. It's like, so they land, have a bunch of stormtroopers outside, and then you get your tension that way, and they have to escape the ship without them realizing. It's just stuff like that. Why, Why did you do this? Why did you make everyone so stupid? Why did you have to do it? You didn't have to do it like this. Redrafting probably would have... Well, this is like... It's so dire. Know. It's you so are. dire. Like, we need... We get everybody where we need them to be regardless. I don't... I still don't understand how Reva got to the, the guy before. No, like, there's no, a the, tunnel, right? It's the, how did you know I where the tunnel went? How would you know where the tunnel well, went? Well, you, but there's I thought one you'd... tunnel, right? I thought there was just one path. Yeah. There, have... there must not be. There yes. must not be. Which means... otherwise she would have run past Leia. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> well, it, it, she would have uh, bumped into the other girl who was heading back to help Kenobi out. Yes. Yeah. But, but, but and and so, both ways. And so we have to conclude ways. that there is a series of tunnels down there, and she happened to pick the right one and get ahead of Leia. <laughs> like, what mm -hmm. the fuck? How does that make yeah. any sense? Wait. But what that means is that the the girl that was helping him, she didn't tell Leia. Okay, when there's a fork in the tunnel, you take left. She, well, maybe they were past the fork at that point, Rex. Oh, maybe they were past the fork, of course. Astounding Which, that Leia had that much of a head start and she got ahead of her. It's fucking incredible. It is. And, and you'd think, think sorry, the closest point we between the, the two would be to run down the tunnel. Leia is now in, in the, the Empire's end. custody. Again. Yeah. Well, and, that's and she's been traveling with Obi-Wan Obi Kenobi. Yeah. Both Obi-Wan and the lady, both, they both decided, because Obi-Wan has a responsibility, he does, to get back to Tatooine, to take care of luke like he needs to do that um yep. and then he decides to run off to go fight vader and potentially die yep and then like the second one as well is this lady is like hey can you make sure that leia gets to safety like that's all i need from you and then she's like I, you can handle this yourself right leia like you can find your way on your own i gotta go help obi-wan they Thank both you. abandoned her what? Yeah. Absolutely Crazy. fucking insane that they both abandoned it, yeah. And, and, like, I want to ask the people who made these scenes, like, do you think this makes the OT better? Do you, do you think, think that seeing all of this <laughs> makes it- Yeah, they're like, ah, this makes it so much richer when- <laughs> Like, it makes it so when, much yeah, richer when- Yeah, when Obi-Wan Obi meets, is... yeah, Darth Vader, that makes it so he... meaningful. When only one says to Luke, yeah, he's a good friend, he remembers how he got burnt, <laughs> like, put in the fire. <laughs> his arm is like, yeah, he's a good friend. What I mean, that scene works way better when everything between never these two were just the years. prequels. Because yeah. of Obi-Wan having done so much to Anakin. He knows what Anakin did, but yeah, yeah. dragging him through burning coals, or whatever the hell this was. <laughs> that was so stupid. That was really stupid, yeah. God, I... Keep doing it. Just keep fucking Fuck. shit up. I, I'm so glad that they've dragged Vader down along with Obi Wan. We we got to do them both. We got to make them both yeah. insanely stupid and idiotic. We need a level, <sighs> a level field for everyone. Everyone needs to be as retarded as the other one. It's so funny that they stormtroopers like... are stupid. Obi Wan's stupid. Darth Vader's stupid. Yeah. Everyone's stupid. If you accept at this point that Star Wars is like just a series where everyone has like an IQ of thirty, 
Um, brain damage is still um, too much. And like that's just like how intelligent people are in this universe, right? It then and then like and, and the original trilogy and some points in the prequels, is it like you know, there are some anomalies. <laughs> And like you know, yeah. there's just some people they get lucky and they have some good ideas by chance. Then you know, I think everything everything lines up. That that load of robots re incredibly slowly moving away with Obi Wan's body while there's all these stormtroopers that can just walk around. Beta no, 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 people can't walk around things in this universe. If no. it's like if it's if something is between them and the Wait, thing they want to get to, they can't pew, 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 pew. they can't they can't sort that out. Just like, <sighs> Like, oh, Vader legit is like, oh, no, fire. And it's like, you, you just put it out. And he's like, oh, no, Obi-Wan's too far away. It's like, how did you beat him just now? With your, but with it your doesn't far even look like powers? It doesn't even look like Vader is doing anything. Or it's like concerns. Like, uh, well, so I guarantee the first defense there. for all of this from fans will be like, no, 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 no. Vader wanted this. He wants uh, Obi-Wan to escape what's... because he wants him to feel fear or some bullshit. That's it's why he let good, the though. stormtroopers keep shooting at him. Yep. Gotcha. <laughs> It's especially okay. good with the um the, the fact that every other time that it looked like Obi-Wan was going to escape, Vader just teleported there out of nowhere. Yeah. It's so transparently just, yeah, the show wants him to escape now. Fuck you. Well, yeah, yeah. so it's actually a point for that, right? So you've got, there's an mm -hmm. exit tunnel that leads to a pilot that leads to a ship that gets you off planet. It's like, okay, and Vader is, you can see him in front of you past your uh, sort of shelter. He doesn't know where you are. It's like, all right, all right. well, with everything you've explained to me, Sounds like our heroes can get out of here because they'll sprint down that tunnel away oh. from Vader and towards salvation, right? And you're like, no, actually, none of them can get out because of this situation. Like, oh. And then you're like, they are meters away from Vader, heavily injured, slow, and uh, nowhere near any kind of uh, right. ship or pilot or any help. But they escaped because the episode ended there. Oh. Talent. I've Very never talent. seen... Yeah, Obi Wan Kenobi's twenty feet in front of you, and you're watching him get carried away, and you won't just put out the fire again and get him, or you won't just walk around. You won't just grab walk him. around. Grab him with a force. You came all this way. Lift you came all up. this way across the galaxy to this planet to come fetch him, and here he is, twenty feet in front of you, and you're like, Nah, I guess he. Which I'm not even sure how that works out time wise. With the weird slow ass probes. I don't think that ever works in finally time. Finally got there and. Vader is here and Riva and all the other ones. I just, I just, just, just it doesn't it take about the same amount of time to get from Mustafa to this planet as it does to get from wherever that is. I guess, yeah, 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 because yeah. you got Obi Wan goes from city planet to new planet, and then Riva goes from city planet to planet where her bosses live to have the a meeting about planet? how they need to send out the drones. Drones are sent, mm -hmm. and they okay. arrive and are prepared for Kenobi. Like, oh, of course, the timeline. How yeah, is it ten even minutes after up? he's yeah. arrived? Yeah, that's that what I'm trying to say. Yeah, no, well, <laughs> no, I knew that's what you were trying like, to say. I was were, trying to line out exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Out. They were there for like a day at most, and by a day, I mean like twelve hours. <laughs> like and, the yeah, 12 yeah hours. Like, travel it, takes time. Felt to me like it was fucking twenty minutes, like in real time. Yeah. Well, really, it was right with all of the time. Was funny that, that maybe they got. What yeah. he was like, oh, it's a long story. He's like, it's a long trip. It's like, no, it's not. It's literally like one minute. Two minutes. Two minutes. A minute. Yeah. But I know like, someone might be like, nah, it's just montage cuts. They didn't talk about anything else. I like how they else. were just standing out in the field. They're just the in is, a field. Oh well, yeah, they were ra they were ravaging that field. Obi Wan That's is what so the Empire bad. does. They just ravage. Obi Wan's so bad at being oh, secretive that if their conversation lasted for a half hour, then it's over because he wouldn't be able to keep lying. They would just be like, oh, so, so you know, where in this country or where in this planet did you did your um your wife die or where were you visiting? He has no idea what the names of anything here are. Yeah. Also, it doesn't even work out with the lady who was supposed to meet him there. Like, apparently she was there, but he was gone. Yeah, because he didn't so wait. So they must have driven... Yeah, they were like, on water each other planet. at some point. And then she go went back, get her uniform, get onto the transporter with the with, with the stormtroopers that happened Hep to head there where Obi-Wan is. I just, no, no, it doesn't work. She it's didn't it's even... not enough time for wait. anything of this to happen. And uh, she would have known they were, they were at the outpost because she was heading there. Because um, yeah, she she had all this not. She didn't call ahead to be like, oh, don't worry about checking those two. You know, I I know yeah. them. They are locals. Don't worry about it. They've been here for years. Or they visited before. I know them. She didn't try that. She was just like, no, I'm gonna sacrifice my position and kill all of you. Yeah. <laughs> That's so stupid. This oh. episode yeah, is she... really really broken. <laughs> it's Terrible. Yeah, she... Not even funny. Like it's absolutely. It was never broken. funny, Bell. Sometimes it is funny, but this isn't funny. This is just bad. No, yeah, this it's is frustrating. Sad. It is frustrating. Like if you well. can't even, as, <sighs> as, a, as a writer, you can't even can't even make sure that the places where your characters go actually make sense. I mean, I'm sorry. Like I don't know what I'm gonna tell you. 
It's like, this is like uh it, it's like I'm theater sorry. of the mind, but you have vertigo. They weren't focusing on uh, on logistics though. They you know they were focusing on making sure that they nailed the um <laughs> the character. That's true, yeah. The character. <laughs> It, it is, is. This is one of the biggest wasted, like, like the, in, in terms of that that narrative opportunity cost. This is one of the the biggest losses I've ever seen. Really, it's like you could have it's made a million dollars instead. You had to pay twelve. Oh, it's like Disney don't want to make money because I know that people will be like, "What do you mean it's the most successful?" And I'm like, "Shut up!" It would have been way more successful if it was well written. I'm just thinking about the future. Yeah, you imagine as well. what a killing they'd like, be making if all of the stuff they were putting out was gold. People would be obsessed with it. They'd be talking about it. Those people who aren't even don't even we care about would. Star Wars. We'd would be, be start like, man, it. I can't. Yeah, oh, we'd yeah. be saying, I can't wait for the next show because everything they it's make like, is good to okay. It's like they le legitimately forgotten that franchises start up somewhere. You know, like yeah. Arcane as a as a as an IP. It's like a lot of people wouldn't even know it has anything to do with LOL until someone tells them. It didn't have like the Ben. Like that name is going to get around the more they have good seasons and the mm -hmm. more people be drawn in. Like, Star Wars can always do that. It seems to be relying almost exclusively on people who even know it exists anyway, and are just watching it for that reason. So I saw an original sci-fi series um, a while ago. Honestly, quite a lot better than what we saw today, um, and it didn't get around. It was called Another Life. <laughs> um, quite a lot better. <laughs> it has not started, honestly, yet. Like, quite, like, I, I, quite a lot might be pushing it, but, like, better. Yeah. Easily better uh, than episode three, at least. Maybe... Probably worse than episode one, yeah, you maybe on par with episode two. You could say but anything like, and say it's better than this, and I'll just believe you. It, it's um, it didn't like, like it, it didn't start a franchise. In fact, it was cancelled after two seasons because no one gave a shit about it because it was bad. <sighs> episode three, everybody. And you that was. Funny I mean, we got life. episode one was uh, not good, but, but yeah, not terrible. Episode yeah. two was terrible, and this is just a disaster. Yeah, and it's only gonna get worse. Imagine what four, five, and six have in store. I wanna. Oh. They gotta, I'm gonna. I'm gonna be honest. I think they're gonna have to try to get worse than this. That's well, fair, watch but, them. You know, it's have, gonna be have, bad. Have some faith, Rangs. Yeah, maybe they didn't I do try. think it will be uphill from try. here. It's gotta be uphill from here. Maybe Surely. the next episode will have five writers. Maybe. <laughs> Ooh, that means it'll be even better. Five what's better than four writers? Five. What if one of them actually had a really great story to tell and is super talented, but the other three dipshits in the room wouldn't let them get the <laughs> ideas down? Three so of them just had like, really uh, good stories to tell. Oh, and the one was just that <laughs> bad, or they had the most influence. Or like, what? Okay, I could even see a scenario where like all four of them had great ideas and great stuff that they wanted to do, and then the studio was like, "Hey, you all guys need to work together." Oh, I like that idea. Put this in here, but like incorporate this other idea as well. But that doesn't. Yeah. No, yeah. that's what we want. Like, I could see that happening. Yeah, yeah. like yeah, Master Chief, he'll be a special foreigner guy. Yeah, not all humans. Yeah. We'll do that, and then we'll take this part over here, and we'll do, just combine them all together. And then, and then Obi Wan Kenobi and Darth Vader they meet in at night in the dirt pile, and, and then Obi Wan runs away, and, and and it's great. And we'll have the music, and it won't even matter because we're showing Darth Vader, and it won't even matter, and, and, and it, it won't even matter. Yeah. Bye. 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 I know that you. I know one. that you watch these to to control your pain. Well, oh. that was great. I guess we'll see everyone later. Bye. Kill me. Can you maybe talk about sort of how you went about developing Vader's physicality in the armor? Because this is a character that, that existed before I was even alive, uh, there's just a, a continuity there that, that we needed to adhere to. Um, so I think we, we all felt it was very important to get that right. And Deborah had a, um, a Vader specialist movement on set for us to make sure that everything sort of rang true. And We've never seen Vader like he is in Kenobi. There's absolutely nothing funny about his entrance in this episode. I saw in his eyes, I saw the... That's fucking... What'd you bring me?